Hello, so we have a science experiment today. If you do not have the supplies at home to do it at your house with your family, then you can watch this video and I am doing it now. So welcome to my kitchen. We are only needing a few simple supplies for this experiment. So during this time of Easter, we get a lot of sweet treats that we can eat. One of those is our peeps. Peeps are marshmallows covered in sugar, and they're usually shaped like a bunny or a chick, and they come in a lot of different colors. So we're going to be using peeps today and seeing how they react in different kinds of liquids. So the liquids that we have are water, just simple water, Vinegar. Remember vinegar we've used in other experiments where it kind of smells a little stinky. Sometimes it's used in food or um, other things at your house. I'm sure you probably have vinegar at your house. And a soda. I was hoping to have a light colored soda, but Mrs. Glare loves root beer, so that's what we have at my house. So we are going to put those into three different cups. You have a paper at your house. Or if you don't have it, if you weren't able to print it off, just draw a picture of three cups, okay? And what we're going to do is we are going to draw a picture of what happens to the peep when they're in that liquid for a while. Now, it's not going to happen right away, but we want to see how the different liquids change our little bunny peeps. So... I'm gonna stand up a little bit more to get my supplies into my cups, and then we will start. So first, I'm gonna put some soda in the cup. Move our peeps out of the way. Look at all those bubbles. Then some vinegar. Let's see if we have bubbles in the vinegar. I'm gonna move this to the side. We don't need it now. Well, it's clear, right? Doesn't look like anything, but I can already smell the vinegar. And last but not least, water. I am horribly pouring that. I'm going to need to get a paper towel. Hold on one second. Accidents happen, right? Especially with the science experiments and there's different things that you're working with. Sometimes you make a little bit of a mess, but what's important is that you clean it up when you make that mess. So we have our three liquids here, our soda, our vinegar, and our water. The next step is to add a peep to those liquids. So. I'm going to bring a peep close to the camera so that you can see what he looks like all by himself. So, the little peep, he's squishy because he's a marshmallow. You can see the white marshmallow inside. He's got lots of sugar on. You can see on my hands, there's already sugar all over my hands. So oh, let's add this little guy to the water first. He's gonna go in for a little swim. Oh, he's floating. Mm -hmm. Okay, the next peep is going in this stinky vinegar. That pop is still bubbling. All right, last. Liquid, the soda. Oh, do you see it's causing more bubbles? The water is starting to turn blue. So is the vinegar. I'm going to bring the pop one closer so that you can maybe hear it. Lots of bubbles. I can hear the bubbles working. What do you think those bubbles are doing 
to the peak. Hmm. We'll wait just a little bit longer. I can see in the water one that the blue is starting to come off more. That sugar. Not a whole lot is happening to the vinegar one right now. I'm going to set a timer. for two minutes. And after two minutes, we will see what happens. I'm gonna adjust the camera so maybe you can see it a little bit better. because I'm not the important one in the camera. The experiment is. All right, we have 30 seconds down, which means we're gonna have another minute and 30 seconds of letting those liquids work their magic or maybe not do anything to those peeps. So are they going to melt them? Will the liquid change? Will the peep change at all? The pop is still bubbling. Not a lot happening to the vinegar one. The water one. More and more of that color is coming off. You can see that the water is changing colors. In the video, you can't really see the different color, but I'll make sure to take a picture and upload it so you can see it maybe a little bit better than in the video. All right, only 30 seconds left, and then we will see what happens. Once the video is over, I will keep letting it sit, and I will upload another picture of maybe what happens after an hour of them being in the liquid. But we can't have a video on that whole time, just watching peeps float. I don't know how fun that would be. But we'll let the liquids keep working and seeing at that over time what happens to those peeps. Still bubbling away. So this is the time. Oh, my timer's going off. So if you were able to print that paper, I want you to get it right now so that you can start your pictures. If you did not print it, that is a-okay. Draw three circles. And inside those circles, you will make the different pictures. So we have the water up first. Now, the only colors you're gonna need to use is maybe a light blue for the water because the water changed colors, right? And the peep. So, I'm gonna try and show you. Look at the back side of the peep. All of that blue sugar is off. It's kind of slimy. Here, we'll flip him over while we look at the rest of them. So. In that circle, you will make a little bit of a blue water. And then the peep is now white. He's no longer blue. So the water took all of the color and sugar off of that peep. Now let's look at the vinegar. The vinegar is even lighter blue. It is very, very carefully with a blue. Very, very light. Hardly can even see. So it's taken some of the colors off. Let's see if it's changed at all. A little bit, but not quite as fast as the water. We'll flip him over too. So the same thing is happening as the water one. Now the pop. Let's see, it's still bubbling. Oh, look at that. It's kind of turned it brown because of my root beer, but it almost looks like it's shrinking. Hmm, weird. So I will put him in there. So you can either wait to see what happens after an hour, or you can draw on your paper what happened to the peeps here. So it looks like the water took the color off of the peep. 
and the water really changed to a dark blue color. The vinegar also took the color off, but a whole lot slower. I would say the water, the peep was a lot slimier than the vinegar one. So both of those liquids took the blue away, but the water did it a whole lot faster. Now the soda, this picture should have some brown, and then on top of peep, you can maybe draw some bubbles with your brown, and the sugar is coming off, but not very fast. Now when I touch it, it actually kind of feels crusty on the side that was in the water. So we'll have to see what happens. The peep is now a little bit of a brown color compared to the other ones that are just white with the sugar off. So our video will end here. Hold on, let me see you a little bit more. But I will continue to take pictures of what happens in an hour and what it looks like. And I will post that on the website so that you can see it. And maybe this afternoon I'll leave it and we can take a look at it during our Zoom. So fill out your papers. Talk with your family about why this happened. Why did the peep look different in each different liquid? If you have these supplies at home, try it yourself. But if not, here you go.